Well, hello everyone. Thanks for coming out today. My name is Kevin Griffin. I'm the current Vice President of the Chamber and we're here at the United Services Credit Union for their expansion of service into the whole uh, McTell County area. And with us is Kim Thompson. She's a branch manager. And we also have Bill Carrington, who's CEO of United Services Credit Union. And we're glad to have you here today. Thank you. I'd like to give a little background on the credit union. It started out with uh, Memorial Missions Hospital Credit Union back in the 50s. Um, several years later, St. Joseph's Hospital created a credit union also, and eventually the two merged in together. So in the beginning, it was more or less a medical uh, services credit union. Later on, that started going into some industries here in Old Fort. Uh, Back in 1985, Old Fort Finishing, they took over their credit union. And in April 2009, they joined up with Financial Partners Credit Union in Morganton and uh, have expanded their area to McDowell, Buncombe, Burke, Caldwell, Catawba, Catawba and several other surrounding counties. So um, we're glad to hear you're expanding and wish you the best of luck in the future. Um, this time, uh, we have some. Uh, we have the mayor of Old Fort with us, Garland Norton. Would you like to say anything? Welcome, and we appreciate it being here in the town. Thank you. We also have Amy Johnson, the current president of the chamber, with us. Would you like to say anything? We would like to welcome United Services and say thank you for being a part and being a part of the ribbon cutting. And Glad to be part of this credit union because I'm a part of the credit union also. So, congratulations. Hey, Kim, would you like to say anything about the credit union? Sure, we're excited to be a new member um, with the McDowell Chamber and also very excited that we're open to the community um, for the residents of McDowell County and hopefully we can um, help them financially with any of their needs. We offer checking savings. IRAs, money markets, and we also just lowered our car loan rates and started as low as 2.99%. So we really just want to make sure that our voice is heard in the community and try to um, welcome people to the membership here. Bill, would you like to say anything? Sure. Well, I uh, certainly thank and appreciate the chamber coming out and uh, the support we've received from uh, the town of Old Fort and uh, McDowell County. We look forward to uh, working with everyone. Thank you. I, I met Kim for lunch uh, a couple of months ago and was very impressed with her um, approach to, to being a community institution and wanting to be active and getting involved and reaching out to the community. And we talked about this event, this open house, and I think there are plans for something later, uh, maybe this fall. And she's been real receptive to uh, invitations that we've sent to be involved, and, and so I think it's it's a real asset to have a team like that. I know Kim came from um, staffing background management, and so you have you have to build a team, and she knows about that, and she's she's been very willing to be ready to use us and and reach out. So I, I think that's a huge asset for, for any organization. And I'm looking forward to working with her. In the future. Okay. Yeah, actually,